a recent story because a lot of people have been complaining to me about not warning a home warranty. They feel like it just is a waste of good money. And I hear that a lot. Home warranties get bad reps. Sometimes people associate us with that used car warranty that won't stop calling you and leaving you those spam voicemails. But really what's important to remember is that with a home warranty, we're here to provide protection against your out-of-pocket expenses as a homeowner should something fail due to normal wear and tear. So we're gonna help absorb some of that cost. With a home warranty, you're paying for things at wholesale pricing, which is already gonna save you money versus buying things at retail. So if my AC breaks on 4th of July, what happens? Because it's a process, isn't it? It is, and the home warranty has a process in place because this is how it works. If your AC goes out on 4th of July, obviously it's the hottest month of the year, and these HVAC technicians are busy. They're working sun up to sun down. We work with reputable vendors and contractors here at our local area, so it might take them a while to get out to you. The home warranty is not an emergency service, so we can't come out nights, weekends, immediately as soon as a claim is filed, but we are going to help protect your pocket, and we're going to get out there as soon as possible and fix the problem. And then there's this other one where we're talking about where people have items break in their house and then they call and they want that home warranty now because it's cheaper to pay $600 for the home warranty than it is to pay all that money to fix it. I have a fridge right now is like $3,000. Absolutely. So as long as everything's in proper working condition at the time that the warranty is purchased, then we cover, obviously, specific covered items and appliances and systems in your home. If you do not get a home warranty during the transaction period and you want to purchase it after the fact as an existing homeowner, that's fine. But we always recommend that you have a home inspection done showing that everything's properly working and there's no pre-existing condition. Mm -hmm. And if something breaks before you purchase the home warranty, we can't just come in after the fact and, fact and fix it. That would be a pre-existing condition. So essentially, I can't take my car, drive it into a wall and crash it, and then call and ask for car insurance. Is that it? Correct. Absolutely. Ah, uh, so that's why you're getting a bad rep. They are crashing their cars into walls and then upset because you're not coming in and fixing it. Absolutely. Got it. Awesome. Thanks for coming. Yeah.